Okay, I really think a couple of things that I can bring back with me today um, were the activities that involved the physically getting up and practicing and looking at how um, watersheds affect the community and how uh, we affect the pollution in our community. For instance, with the watershed activity, the creating of your own personal community and watching how the watershed, how it flows down and actually affects the community that they live in will make it more relevant to the student. Um, secondly, with the activity looking at the point source pollution and the non-point um, source pollution and having the students take ownership and create their community and then watch what happens as you line up along the river and pass down your trash from the higher elevations to the lower elevations gives them a realistic view, simple realistic view, um, of how they impact their environment. So I'm really excited to take this back into my classroom and let them get a real world view of how they, even as sixth graders, can impact their environment and water.